as expected here in Boulder, Colorado. A great matchup in Pac-12 women's basketball, but it ends up being the Bruins on the road who get the six-point win over Colorado. Crystal Blanc along with Mary Murphy. And, Mary, oh I don't know gosh. if we would have thought the game went into this way because early on it was all UCLA. They had a 21-point lead at one time. You can't count the buffs out. They regrouped. They got it together, and they made it a ball game. They did. They battled. They played so well in the second half, especially cutting the lead, shooting the ball extremely well. But in the end, it was UCLA that hit the big shot and really offensive rebounds, I think, carried the day. It definitely did, offensive rebounds, and also some three-pointers falling. Carrie Corver was phenomenal for the Bruins. She was, and her teammates did a great job of finding her, and this was the first play of the game offensively for UCLA, and she really set the tempo and just got comfortable. Her teammates got comfortable from beyond the arc, and they just lit it up, scoring against a very good defensive team. And Colorado battled, battled, did a lot of good things, but ultimately just could not manufacture enough offense. Yeah, Corver only threes and free throws, 17 points for her on the other side. There was a superstar playing for the Buffs. A career high, her 1,000th career point, Jen Reese was doing everything. She was, 30 points, and her teammates, much like Carver, just finding her time and time again. She was moving so well without the basketball, playing basketball with tremendous rhythm, catching it, ready to shoot with a beautiful extension and just took over the game simply but just not enough opportunities and not enough time on the clock to win it ultimately. Multiple lead changes in the second half. The Buffs still looking for that first Pac-12 win. If they keep playing like this, they are going to get it. That's going to do it for us here in Boulder. Thanks for being with us on Pac-12.com.